I think one of the worst things to ever happen to society is company rebrands. And I think the one that really stands out the most recently is uh, Twitter. I think this might actually be the worst rebrand I've ever seen in my entire life. Um, and I've been alive for 19 years now. Uh, so that's saying something. I would also like to say, don't mind my background. Uh, you're going to be staring at it for a little bit. So I want to take it upon myself as a graphic design connoisseur to um, essentially rebrand these rebrands that are abominations to society and make your eyes kind of hurt. But the only rule is uh, we're using Microsoft Paint and we can't import images. So I'm not the best drawer and I don't have a pen or one of those tablet things uh, that Osu players use. Uh, I'm using my mouse. Um, we'll see how this goes. Okay, now for the Pringles logo, this is where it gets a little little bad they ruined the pringles logo okay they took away his face they took away his hair they took away his monocle i don't care what anyone says he had a monocle we're adding all of it back today i think the absolute biggest thing that we have to add is his monocle i can't believe they 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 stripped that away from him okay that that was a no-brainer we need to add his face back oh. okay, he may <laughs> he may have gained a little weight that's fine. He also gained another eyebrow. <laughs> I think the best thing we can do for him right now is add a second monocle just to get back at the people who took his first one. He, <laughs> he has two monocles now. I think next we need to add a mouth. I don't know why, but I feel like he could definitely use a pair of nice lips. <laughs> I speak for a lot of people when I say this. Uh, he needs a tan. He needs a nice little tan. He needs some color on his skin. That, <laughs> that this did not work nearly as well as I wanted it to. Okay, we're gonna need to fix him up. Okay, well, this looks fucking horrible. Um, it also looks uneven and not symmetrical because he doesn't have a fourth eyebrow. He is now double stacked on eyebrows. He also needs a uh, fucking lip filler or something, dude. Jesus. I. <laughs> I made Steve Harvey. Um, this is Steve Harvey. And I'm okay with that, actually. I, I, I think Steve Harvey as the Pringles logo just makes sense. I think to finalize my decision with this uh, rebranding of Steve Harvey, we're going to take out the... Oh, that's not the right color. Okay, we're going to take out the P and we're going to replace it with a nice looking S. They're now Shringles, which sounds a lot like sh shingles. Um... You know what? Maybe maybe we double down on the shingles idea. Okay, so we <laughs> we double down on this. It's now shingles, and we got Steve Harvey as our mascot. I don't know what more we could do because this is a ten out of ten. Okay, so first things first, uh, we're fixing this. So I think what we gotta do is change this entire thing um we're gonna make all of this blue uh that's that's not the right fucking button um where is there no bucket oh okay it was working i just wasn't fucking clicking correctly okay so we're going back to the the right shade of blue um actually i have no idea if this is even the shade of twitter already this looks better next next thing we're gonna start actually drawing Ooh. Getting a little spicy now. We're gonna make this into a bird. That's <laughs> that's a bird. Um, and we're gonna give him legs. Blah blah blah. Yeah, I th legs. Mm. Uh, what are we on? Like step three. We're gonna make these into actual wings. I think you guys can see where I'm going with this. Uh, so we're making all this white. Okay, I love Microsoft. Why did I, why did I say I was doing this on Microsoft Paint? <laughs> it looks like a first grader drew it. Okay, anyways. Oh, we forgot eyes. How how could we... Oh, Twitter didn't have eyes. Never mind. We don't need eyes, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest here. It's it's just better. The, the old Twitter bird, what was his name? Okay, it's Larry the bird. This is probably like fucking Penelope the pigeon, bro. This, this is this is this is Penelope the pigeon. Penelope the 
pigeon. I mean, compared to the X, I think this is just automatic improvement. I, I think anything other than an X would have just been better. I give this a, about an, a 10 out of 10, to be honest, uh, if it was my rating. But realistically, I think maybe an 11 out of 10 if someone else was judging. But that's just my opinion. I would bet my life savings you guys didn't know Nokia even did a rebrand this year. This was the most not talked about thing I've ever seen in my life. This rebrand is fucking horrible and it's basically like, dude, just reading this like hurts my head. It's it's like fucking skateboard ramp plus uh, fucking Oreo is less than uh, twin tower and fucking broken in chair. We're gonna need a thicker brush. Uh, we're probably how do I how do I change the size of this actually you know what actually let's let's do something different uh we're gonna do this and we're gonna do this whoa and for the last one we might have to draw it in look how easy that was look how look how legible it is it's not fucking a math equation anymore Already, we're done with this. This this needs nothing more. If you really want to be cool, we can maybe add like the A and it's like a swoosh. You know how Amazon has their swoosh or Nike has their swoosh? Maybe this is like how they're connecting the world. I don't fucking know. Just do some PR bullshit. This is just infinitely better. I rate this another 10 out of 10. I mean, I, I need to be hired for this at this point. Um, I, I think companies need to rebrand around me. I rate this a 10 out of 10. You guys let me know in the comments uh, what you rate Nokia's rebrand versus mine. Um, not to influence your opinion or anything, but um, I have a gun. For the last logo, I had the idea of combining all the worst logos, which you see on the left. Uh, we got Kia, I can't even read that. MasterCard, who lost their entire identity by moving one word. And Gap. Uh... I don't even know what the fuck that is. And then combining them with the best ones on the right. We got Burger King, which granted lost a little bit of color, but honestly, I kind of like it. Taco Bell, more minimal, uh, more minimalistic, but uh, still kind of good. And Pepsi, which reminds me of the 1980s, and I kind of like it, and it's pretty rad. Something that already stands out to me is the background color of the Burger King one. Uh, really nice beige. I think immediately we're gonna have to we're gonna take the MasterCard circles. I think these are really significant in society. I think everybody can recognize MasterCard, especially with the, the circles. We're gonna grab the Taco Bell bell. I mean, everybody knows the Taco Bell bell. I think like that. And I think next we're gonna grab the can for the Pepsi, just cause I think it's a really good rebrand. I think it just makes sense. And yeah, I think, I think this is perfect. This is the company. Uh, corporate America is going to love this one. Can I go higher than a 10 out of 10 on this?